Chapter 1, Introduction, Section 1, General, 1-1, one, one, Purpose and Scope. This manual is to guide basic reference of firefighting terms other than personnel engaged, provider, engineering, firefighting, rescue procedures at a military establishment and theater's operation. It covers the policies and procedures, equipment, characteristics, chemistry of fire tactics, techniques of firefighting, first aid, rescue, fire prevention. It concerned primarily with structural aircraft and petroleum un and unclear for weapon fires, but also discuss discusses explosive motor vehicles and natural cover natural cover fires. The material cover contained herein is applicable to nuclear and non-nuclear warfare. One, two, changes. User in this manual encourages to submit recommendations and changes to comments to improve the management. The comment should be keyed to the specific page, paragraph, line, and text in which the change is recommended, but the reason should be provided with each of the commitment to ensure understanding complete evaluation. Comments should be forwarded directly to the Office Chief of the Engineers. Attention, ENGMCFFF, Washington, D.C. 203. Um, one four, one three. Wet, um, what are fire protection specialists um, must know? The progress in fire protection within the Army has increased greatly in the last few years. The public guess the progress was brought about the development of the new techniques and more efficient equipment, but offsetting the progress to some extent, at least as uh, the turnover of military personnel, the turnover is seriously drawback to the efficiency of broad training programs, which include the study of chemistry, physical mathematics, building construction, now making the firefighting training a continuing process. A chemistry. The creation and spread of fire is a chemical reaction involving the flammable vapors. Since this is the reaction can occur under many of the conditions and circumstances, the firefighter must know the characteristics of fuels and other materials he gains knowledge through the understanding of the chemistry of the fire. B. Physics involves the principles, mechanics, electricity, high light, heat, light, and sound. The firefighter needs the mechanical knowledge to enable them to operate the fire trucks associated with the equipment to maintain them so that they will always be ready for fire. For use, um, electricity is a common source of fire. In addition, there is the danger of electrocution, especially in the presence of water, and water is the common extinguishing agent. Heat is a major consideration in the spread of the fire and physical limitations of the personnel. The light is necessary to combat fire at night in enclosed smoke-filled compartments. Sound, the basis of alarm systems, is foundation of the fast and efficient response to firefighters. <coughs> <coughs> See, mathematics, the fire must know the mathematical formula is used to determine the proper volume and force of the extinguishing agents needed to this knowledge. Men of the fire department of hydraulics enabled the engineer of the pump operator to arrive at the correct nose to pressure. An pressure. An error here may cause injuries, extensive water damage, and excessive fire loss, and too much water pressure at the nozzle has now been um, to throw the firemen from ladders and out of the windows. Window well, all the hoses lines can be seriously injury that kill people who are struck with by heavy nozzle and hose couplings. D. Construction. A basic knowledge of the building construction is essentially for the proper, the forcible entry and rescue ventilation and extinguishment. The buildings that look for the identical on the outside um, may collapse or burn with the very, very great variations of the time because of the difference of the internal design and type of the construction. Men who are in the fire inspection should become familiar with the construction of each of the buildings so that in case of the fire, they will know the approximate length of the time of the building too. Um... Building is safe to enter in the time of the which the must be evacuated before it collapses. One four the policy and the procedure is an important member of the fire protection unit and familiar with the most common policy of the procedure fire protection organization of the army. The forms used, the policy and the forms are described in detail with the army publications in this purpose the chapter. The acquaintance the firefighter with the general principles which are important in the, in the proper performance of their duties. Section 2, uh, Organization 1-5, the fire protection, firefighting science is divided into three phases, fire prevention, rescue, and firefighting. The fire prevention in the phase establishes um, standards procedure for the prevention of the accidental fires. The standards and practices are controlled by frequent surveys and inspections responsibly for inspections for recommending um, corrective action is placed with the fire protection organization. Rescue and firefighting. On arriving at the fire, at the fire, the firefighters must determine the exact location of the fire and then act. The people um, to protect the exposures confine the fire and then extinguish it. Well, while rescuing is not needed at most fires, it must be the first concern. Firefighters must stop the spreading of the fire, protect the exposures of the or confined to the other buildings, but parts of the buildings on the fire before they can apply themselves to the, um, the extinguishment of the fire ventilation, removal of the smoke and heat and gases is part of the salvage effort which may be required at any time during the firefighting operation. If the fire has been extinguished, a final search is made for the glowing and sparking embers. The search and the extinguishment of the rekindling potential are known as overhaul. 
one six firefighting units. The firefighting units provide firefighting prevention services and prevention um, protective measures in addition with distinguishing fire. They also train auxiliary fighting firefighter for firefighters maintaining firefighting equipment advise high commanders of fire defense plans. The firefighting unit consists of four types four types of teams. They may be attached, assigned, and re re required and fixed and strength that they may organize in service of the uh, units of tow five five ten G. The survey units are designed to provide different, different size or organizations with the firefighting team. Depending on tactical, logical consideration involved with the command and administrative control are normally provided with the firefighting headquarters team. A, the Team um, FA Firefighting Headquarters, capability of planning the overall and area of the firefighting prevention and firefighting program and for the control assigned for the attached firefighting teams. B, the basis of allocation, normally one per one per three or five firefighting teams, FB and FD, or one tr water truck team, FC. Strength aggregated as follows. Number, the number one grade LLT, the MOS 9414. Number two, the E6 NCO 51M40. Number one, E37 and D810. Mobility, the 100% mobile. Five major items of the equipment, indiv weapons, individual weapons only, vehicles, trailer, cargoes, quarter ton, three quarter ton, and uh, truck utility, one quarter ton. Um, other bl equipment, blanket, firewood, wood and grommets, a rope or handle, extinguishing fire, carbon dioxide, 50 pounds, extinguisher fire, dry chemical, 20 pounds, extinguished fire foam, two and a half gallons, firefighting equipment set repair for the extinguisher and the fire hose, lighting, warning, light, warning vehicle, red with blinker device, repair with a refill, carbon dioxide, fire extinguisher, sign, electric motor operated with a telephone set TA 312 PT method of operation um, the team leader serves as a fire marshal installation area the responsibility team members conduct the fire prevention inspection train volunteer personnel and firefighting operation in addition with planning overall fire defense and commanding firefighting teams these teams maintain refills fire starting extinguisher makes minor repairs to the fire hoses B, Team FB Fire Truck, capability of providing with the fire protection of mirthly, timely, and adequately first aid and, 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 and implementing fire prevention program for areas of houses of 5,000 to 10,000 troops or warehouse open storage as area of 100,900 square feet or 92... 9,290 square meters. The basis of allocation, one per installation of 5,000 to 10,000 troops containing 100,000 square foot of the 9,290 square meters of the warehouse open storage. Three strength aggregated in six as follows: number one E5 NCO 51 M40, number one A4 NCO 51 M40, number three um, E4 51 M20, E1 number one E3 M4 F51 M20. Mobility a lot 100 mobile one mobility 100% mobile major items the weapons individual weapons we vehicles firefighting equipment set truck mounted with the structural type of overseas over overseas class 530b and 530c other equipment blanket fire wool with garments and rope and wood handle method of operation team members are provided with the fire protection for the teams assigned to installation or area conducting the fire prevention insulate inspection firefighting fire CTM 522 um, five for radiological decontamination. Team FC water truck capability of the capable um, capability capable of transporting water firefighting purposes when not enough water is in the near the fire. To the base of allocation, one or more of the firefighting headquarters of the team FA has required three. The strength and aggregated with its files number one E four five fifty one M twenty and number one E three fifty one one twenty. For mobility, lot 100% mo um, mobile, major items and equipment, weapons, individual weapons, vehicle, the tank, truck, tanker, water, the two and a half ton, other equipment, no other major items, method of operation, team transportation, water fighting with the sufficient water is not a bet. No, both team members may be used and may be used as firefighters. Team FD, the br brush fire truck, capability of capable of furnishing protection against the grass brushes within the assigned the responsibility with augmented with the personal additional hand tools can use be um, limited to degree to combat structural fires to the basis of allocation one per installation of 5,000 to 10,000 troops or containing 100,000 square feet, 9,290 square meters of warehouse or open storage. Three, the strength aggregated two as follows. Number one, E5 NCO 51M40 um, Moss. Number one, um, 
grade E3 Fit Moss 51M20. Mobility 100% mobile. Five major items of equipment. Weapon, eight individual weapons. Vehicle, firefighting equipment, set truck mounted with the brush type. Overseas class 530B and 530C. Other equipment, no other major items. Method of operation. Team members, trained personnel, and supported unit in the brush fire. A brush firefighting supervise them as they engage in aid. Additional handheld axes, maddox, brushes, hooks and must be provided with a supported unit. 17. Responsibility. Area AR, um, Army Regulation 611-211 lists the duties, skills, knowledge, and of uh, the firefighter listed below with the primary responsibility of the fire protection personnel. A. The fire chief is under the direction of the fire marshal supervises the fire protection organization, including the management of the fire suppression, rescue operation, training in the pre-firing planning programs, maintenance of the fire equipment system devices, and he also monitors the fire prevention program. He, uh, he ensures that, one, the fire vehicle personnel is in state of immediate readiness and availability. Two, the training of fire prevention programs are carried out. Three, the resources are efficiently utilized. Four, the duties and align assignments, equipment, um, maintenance, and operational procedures are accomplished. B, the assistant deputy of the fire chief is he assists the fire chief in the carrying out of his duties and assumes the, them in absent, absence. Station uh, chief under the direction of the fire chief, the designated person acts as the station chief. That is, since no position is authorized for the duty, the person assigned will also perform the duty as a crew chief. He will supervise all chiefs out to his station, and he will, one, implement the policies regulations of the basic fire protection organization, hire headquarters, respond to the crews to alarms, emergency calls, ensure adequacy for the fire suppression rescue operations. When the first arrive at the scene with the emergencies, assume command until the arrival of the senior fire authority supervises assists in the training and conducting crew members and conducting regular, regular drills to maintain maintain efficiency of the firefighting rescue operations. D. Crew Chief. He will um, he will supervise over all operator inspection and maintenance of the fire vehicles, inspect them, upkeeping protection with the fire organization property. Two, ensure the safe arrival of the vehicles with the full complement of the equipment and personnel of the scene of the emergency. Two and three, the respond his crew and equipment alarm, fire, commandment for emergencies, vehicle rescue emergencies, routine calls, including reciprocal movements as is directed for the, um, when first the due arrives to assume command until relieved by the senior fire authority. Five, five, perform the station chief's duties and delegated with him and dictated with the emergency condition. E. Firefighters. Uh, each firefighter normally is assigned a specific duty re related to the equipment operator of the firefighting rescue. All personnel, however, that will cross the train capability of flexible action and fire situation rescue emergency. Firefighters will keep apparatus, equipment, tools, and uniforms clean and serviceable. Respond with uh, the assigned unit to all alarms and emergency calls. Distinguish the fire and take necessary precautions to prevent them from being rekindled. Be careful to avoid unnecessary damage and to loss to the department of the property and jury of himself or other personnel. Watch, the, watch for and protect the scenes of the fire and all clues evidence indicating the fire causes. 6. Participate in the fire prevention programs. E F. Training the fire, fuck, the fire truck operator drivers emergency type of the vehicles must attain the following minimum test scores emergency judgment test of 108 road test 90 individual now achieving the above minimum qualifications will have the standard form 46 driver qualification record of the da form 348 stamped limited license Refresh training will be provided with the annually in to ensure the familiarity with emergency operational requirements for the type of the vehicle being operated. Special attention will be given to understand legal limitations required by the installation by local law. Any operator or emergency vehicle who is involved in the accident will have his or his permit suspended pending on the completion of the remedial driving training. Any operator with an emergency vehicle who is involved with an accident committed any moving violation which will have his permanent revoked. 7. Should a requirement exist in the driver to be retrained and tested for the driving other than emergency vehicles, the driver and permit will be, stamp, will, will be stamped. Army limited, not valid for emergency vehicles. 8. A proper entry will be made on the driver qualification card of the DA Form 348 to assure that the above information qualification of the limitations are known. Availability of the motor officer in case of reassignment to the, of the driver or loss of permit. Section 3 Facilities 1 through 8 Introduction Firefighters will often spend 24 hours or more duty on the outside and locality in order to assure the rapid response on the fire alarms. It should be housed in the suitable living facilities when available, including the necessary comfortable working, sleeping, eating, and the recreation, training, and studying in inadequate facilities can greatly lessen the efficiency of fire protection organization when not on duty firefighters are on call in case of the grave emergency. 
Um, one nine structural stations. A structural fire station must be strategically located in the area expected to protect. Usually, a center located so that each of the portion um, of the area will have much of the protection as possible. Sighting in any other portion, however, the one portion is a high risk. In this, comparing with the rest of the area, the station's locality, the station's location is a natural favor of high risk portions. Um. B risk reason for the consideration area of the high risk is including the speed of the in in ignition of flammable materials located, the propagation of the possibility of potential amount of loss of fire occurs. The portion of the area contained the hospital, technical buildings, barracks, headquarters, buildings, or other buildings in which the life of the property to low loss potential is greater than or necessarily classified critical for the standpoint of a fire hazard. Um, one 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 one. Crash station. Crash stations. Location of an aircraft fire rescue station is limited to the vicinity of the airfield, but the location, even with the limitation of the utmost importance, an aircraft fire rescue station must be centrally located. At the same time, it may be positioned that there will be an open view of the all aircraft actively, including the flying field and running runways, ramps, parking areas, taxi strips, and dis dispersal areas of the crash station. One one sleeping quarters. Sleeping in the bunking of the facility should enable the crew of the both of the aircraft and the fire rescue structural organizations to reach the apparatus for quickly and safely with the alarm sounding during the um, sleeping hours. The bear fire firefighter is expected to wake him, throw the back of the blanket, swim, spin around, and insert both fan feet into his boots, stop, stop, st stoop, and pull out his pants, run around the apparatus floor with placing his surrenders over the shoulder, and finally mount the truck, ready to no action all in about 15 seconds. He can do this only in the, if the quarters are so designed the distance for the sleeping quarters to the apparatus is short and impossible passageways are wide and clear in the area is complete from obstruction which might cause delay or injury. 112 Dining Facilities Dining facilities include the quarters must be located with the necessity rather than the comfort of luxury because of the periods of absences of the fire station eating greatly reducing the strength of the organization even if no than few persons here are absent in a short time. 113 heat stations. Um, each structural crash station should be promptly heated and ventilated. The comfort of the personnel will ensure the men willingly and efficiently perform their inside duties well and keeping the equipment in excellent condition, training, and study, study periods are even required. Assessing firefighters to advance the refresh technical knowledge. Personal comfort is necessity to the man who is trying to absorb such a knowledge and proper than willing temperature is necessary for the personal comfort. Shower and latrine facilities are essential to the health, comfort, and cleanliness of all fire protection personnel. The facility should be placed with a responsible clause, place of um, a pr apparatus floor. It is, it is uh, returning to the fire from the fire. The men are frequently wet, cold, dirty, and showers help to prepare them for rapid or any other person possible emergency while showering. The, um, the men should keep the bolts and paint, closing them in case of the alarm that they can put put them in immediate and put them on immediately. 114 training facilities for important purposes, particular training which serves the pro providing medium for the theories of the pre presented classroom. The traditional training ground or areas should be provided with the fire protection crews. Training ground should be located, in, if possible, po position with a response to any of the portion of the um, part of the t area may be made with a minimum of the time. The training area must have the supply of water ample to replenish the supply of the vehicles. Trainers or stimulated stipulated, stimulated structures should be provided to enable the actual fire ignition control extinguishment according with the standing operating procedure. Neither the entire aircraft fire rescue or the crew nor the entire structural crew will be ever will be out of service at any one time while attending the training ground responsible enable protection will be immediately available at all times a reading or study room is greatly accessed the tour or maintaining the press of study of the mid training and schedule 116 millimeter projector should be available with a single library for showing the training fields to set in films a set of technical manuals or order um orders should be furnished along with any other helpful publication study room must be well lit and comfortable inviting them so that they encourage the individual study a store room a repair shop with a combination of two that should enjoy the fire station or so that the crew may Members studying the apparatus here work there and will not be far away from the duty stations. Section 4 DA form ran report DA form reports and records. Fire protection firefighting operations require the reports and records they are used to determine the effectiveness of the firefighting rescue operation for the appraising of the firefighting prevention regulation programs and training for the evaluation of fire protection engineering equipment and devices. Statistical data enable the organization to analyze, evaluate, and storm conditions and effective changes and to improve the efficiency reports are required for a fire incident. 
in which involve the disabling disa death or disabling injury to a person or damage to the description of a building, structural grounds, utility plant, or system installed with the movable equipment, aircraft, missile vehicle, material supplies, personal property. Uh, so technical investigations are necessary for the fire incidents to analyze cause, contribution factors, sex. Um, to determine the effectiveness of the measure and taking the required to be taken, the, the other such emergencies record records are required for the fire protection equipment systems or devices that may be particular peculiar into insulations routines should be made in inspection and hazards. On one one six forms listed below are the forms to be in, used in inspection for the testing of firefighting equipment. DA form two fifty um, three, the fire station fire extinguisher record of the tag. The DA form two fifty three is attached to each installed in extinguisher for the recording of the monthly inspection and recharging. The DA form five one, DA form five one, the department individual running of the re report. This form is designated to give the information response made in the individual fire units. Formally, um, the list information such materials are at alarm for the re reception response type of the apparatus, dispatch, dispatch location, nature of the emergency, other type of the response equipment used in hose line operations. DA Form 52 Fire Report. The form is designed to furnish information about the fire incidents, uh, incidents which affect the life in the report property is used to identify the incident related with the operation, provide the close estimates of the monetary loss, damage, obstruction of the property, material, and equipment. Three, indicate the loss of life, the extent of the nature of physical injury owned to fire. Four, indicate the extent of the nature of continued contingent loss and the effect of the installation mission. Five, the dis remaining the continued cause and the contribution fa factors. Six, evaluate improve fire protection organization personal equipment training and procedures determine action to take prevention similar occurrences da form 578 fire hose record this form records inspection testing and maintenance for all the fire hoses and type of the coupling provided with the remarks and section da form 5118 annual dry pipe valve inspection type tripping test this form is provided with a recording of the tripping cleaning and resetting of the dry of the dry pipe d lodge Involved that are un the, with their accessories. DA Form 519 Automatic Sprinkler Standpipe Equipment Inspection Test. This form is used in inspection testing. Maintenance personnel is completed with the inspection of the test is made with the operation of sprinkler valves and fire pumps. DA Form 2404 ins Equipment Inspection Maintenance Worksheet. The equipment inspection and maintenance, sheet, maintenance worksheet is used by all personnel performing inspections, providing maintenance ser services, diagnostics, and checkouts. Equipment serviceability criteria checks and provided with the standard procedure for the temporary. Recording equipment deficiencies. All right, 117 records and reports. Records and installation livable to be prepared with the qualified prevention personnel will be approved with the operating agency commander with the authorized representative. The form are to be prepared with the AR 3101 application will be used to record the technical de the details of the operational testing of the following reports for the additional information on the technical manual 388 750. Hey, the automatic sprinkle water flow, water flow and low air pressure automatic manual fire alarm system report complete. Permanent records will be kept. The operational fire alarm system inspection testing service method put forward and additional inspection testing record forms and impairment tags will be provided for the use of the devices found inoperable, not immediately repairable. Um, 5B, the fire header is inspection. The use for the either the fire inspection knows of the fire header inspection report. The procedure to be used can be determined locally. The main reason for using the fire inspection notice of the stream action, but the reducing the time record completed with the fire inspection requirements. Um... The establishment of goodwill cooperation between the fire organization and the activities occupying the structure will be revealed with the major fire hazards can be resolved. Within this procedure, the fire, for the situation where the fire inspection notice does not um, prove satisfactory, this does not adequately fire hazards and inspection report will be used regardless of the procedure filed with all hazards and deficiencies discovered during any inspection, which cannot be or not corrected during the inspection, will be recorded to ensure all hazards Records are the form uh, for, are on this form and are correctly f uh, quickly followed up by the fire inspector necessary the time allowed to correct the hazard. Well, um, can vary from 1 to 72 hours depending on the potential dangers involved will be listed on the form. The training timetable The training timetable is a simple chart to assist the supervisor identifying the planning and scheduling the training needed for the employees. It means the recording of the operation that each employee can perform. The operation on which the employee needs to be trained, the date of which the train should be, training should be started. The chart may be in the form of size depending on the purpose and size of the work of the force. Even, when, uh, even with the complexity of the work itself may be also called with the train schedule work of the schedule charter. Um, chart. The essentially features may be incorporated with the operation guide with the work distribution control 
chart and control chart. However, the one prepared is giving is the overall picture of the specific training to be done at the unit. The training timetable is corrected using to serve the following purposes. One, aid and identify the planning and the schedule of training. Two, check the, and the extent of the training is carried out with the plan. Three, the ed, aid is determined where there will be the trained as necessary for the accomplishment of the mission. Four, Aids are assigned in assigning works D log. Each fire protection organization will maintain a daily log containing information on the duty assignment of the vehicle movement, the mechanical status report of fire, incidents, emergency fire alarms, alarms received by the alarm transmission over, over automatic manual sprinkler system, special extras that name the visitor, injuries to personnel, etc. The log may be typed out or prepared by hand on a ten eight by ten and a half sheet or um Bond paper maintained in the bound notebook. It will be reviewed and approved for the senior officer in charge at least close of the work shift. Section 5, Communications. Um, introduction to the fire protection facility installation must be an adequately communication system. These, system. these consist of a telephone system, automatic and the manual for water form, allowing autom all alarm system, two-way radio, visual, aerial signs, one nine, telephone system. Facilities and the reporting of the fires uh, post on camps and stations mo at most locations be standardized. Fires may be reported through installation telephone and through special systems on the outside. Fire reporting telephones installed with the box connected with, directly with the alarm board with the, at the main fire station. External firefighting telephones are housed in metal boxes pointed, mounted on poles, external walls, buildings in place for the, so that one of them could be rapidly, easily with a possible po post location. These boxes are printed yet um, red, usually red target light m m mounted over them so that they will be visible at night. To report fire over the fire reporting telephone, a person must be open the box, lift the telephone receiver, give the information to the alarm board operator in the outdoor storage area where the telephones and the fire reporting uh, telephones are widely scattered and single signs should be posted throughout the area to sh so show where the fire reporting facilities are located um 120 automatic manual and water flow alarms with the following system alarm to the transmitted with electrical impulse reported recorded on tape in the central fire station alarm room a, an automatic fire detection alarming system. This system is installed where it is not infeasible to install the automatic sprinkler system. The dormitory type of the combustible buildings where the individual sleeping room should be have an automatic fire protection de detection system. The automatic fire detection alarm system incorporates some of the devices sensitive to heat and fire smoke. The devices cause an electrical operated with the transmit to send the code signal to the fire station alarm system. Um, two high sensitive devices used in the fire protection system be either the fixed temperature or fire rate for the of the rate rate of the rise rate of the rise thermostats. Fixed temperatures thermostats will be accurate actuate actuate the transmitter with a predetermined degree of the temperature is created with the unusual circumstance. The rate of the rise of the thermostats will actually transmit what and when a fire or other sources of heat are caused if the temperature rise at a rate faster than normal. The rate of the rise devices must be using a fixed temperature device. Manual alarm system. Manual alarm system usually installed with the air is not provided with the sprinkler automatic fire detection um, system. Water um, watchman services are provided within these areas. Manual alarm boxes are located strategically throughout an area and are usually operated by opening the box and pulling the lever. Due to the different type of the boxes, operation will be barely only local alarm is normally provided with certain conditions. Code signal may be sent to the fire station alarm. See water flow alarm system. Water flow alarm system are those that transmit the code signal of the fire station alarm when ruptured with the sprinkler head causes the water to flow through the pipe of the sprinkler system. The loss of the air pressure of the dry pipe system will cause the local alarm and may allow also transmit the code signal to the fire station alarm. 521, fire to department radio. The provision of two-way radios for structural fire apparatus substituted with the fire alarm system because of such radios usually are not available to both Bull post personnel for the reporting of the fires. A radio is installed with the structural apparatus used successfully, but installed with the d details of specific orders to fire crews which are en route to the scene of the emergency at any other time when the apparatus is away from the station. Radios are usually installed with the smaller, faster vehicles since the trucks are normally fa first arrived or upon arrival. The auxiliary equipment additional emergency assistance can be operated with the radio without delay. Frequency of the radio equipment on the crash rescue apparatus should be the same as the frequency of the air ra field radio tower. The portable radio of the firefighters are advantages. They permit the fires to engage for the vi various activities to be available for the for fire call.
All right, 122, radio terms procedure. Several standardized radio terms and procedures may be understood using the fire crews. Terms Roger may seem received the, your message. Two, Wilco means you received your message and where applicable will comply. Say again, I say again, and that is correct. The self-explanatory to correct something said to the wrong, that it work, that work wrong is used followed by the correction. Um... Wait if you used it. Wait if you used it itself means it must pause for a few seconds and request the other station to stand by, refrain from transmitting for a period of not exceeding 30 seconds. If you, if the pause is too longer, up to one minute, the expression was wait out is used to request an even longer standby period. The expression wait out is sued in which the blanket is replaced by a numerical identification of the number of minutes the other station is requested to stand by. Um, Note the spirit the standby period usually requested by the operator has to perform a duty with his attention away from the transmitter and receiver who has to handle communicators higher priority, the greater urgency. When requested to stand by the station normally is expected to remain in the status until the advisor invited with the remain resumes transmission. Numbers transmitted numbers as follows in standard pronunciation should be uh, used. Zero, one, two, three, thou free, flower, five e. Six and seven and eight and nine are letters when necessary to identify the letter alphabetical spell of the word and the new standard phonetic al alphabet should be used. Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Foxtrot, Golf, Ho Hotel, India, Juliet, Kilo, Lima, Mike, November, Oscar, Papa, Quebec, Romeo, Sierra, Tango, Uniform, Victor, Whiskey, X-Ray, Yankee, Zulu. Words not understand will be spelled phonetically. For example, the phonetic um, transmission type of the 05 would be um, made as follows. The Tango, Yankee, Papa, Echo, Papa, Echo, 5. The following procedure for the established communications with the other units making the initial call. Once the communication is established between each of the message with the truck identification number conclude with the proper closing remark, all passages will end in an over and out, whichever the appropriate over means the may, might the transmission ended with the expected the response. Our means and conversation is ended with no response is expected. Over our over and out are never used to together in to end the transmission. Um Crews should keep the radio equipment clean and protected with the weather. Particular care must be given to the condition of the battery, which must be tested frequently and charged when necessary. 123 hand st standards. Um, hand signals. Standards throughout the surface are visual and signals between the senior manner and the charge of the bomb that operated with the structural fires. The singles, mo singles may be given to the hand during the day and the flashing of the light during the ladder and during the night. They cover the most of the orders used transmitted for the senior pump and the pop operator. The pump operator must constantly on alert of the sit for the signals must acknowledge all the single of the repeating with them. Sing their signals are easily understood and sensed that in most cases it suggests the action desired. The single m signals must be deliberate for the car careless signals may be understood should the necessary additional signals may develop and fill specifically in the special needs. However, they will be distinctly different from all the standard signals and should be understood by all consideration. Standard hand signals are charged the line, the shutoff water line, KC's operations increase pressure and decrease pressure. Um, charge line during the day, the signal is given by the raising of the both arms vertically from the shoulder part almost to the front and holding them stationary until the signal is acknowledged as is shown in figure A. Shown in A, figure 1 1, and at night, and given with the holding of a flashlight, ladder in one hand, raising the arm vertically above the head of the beam is directly toward the pump. The operator lighting swung horizontally above the head, as shown in B, figure 1 1. Shut off the water in the line. The signal is a temporary shutdown to allow the line, to repair, line for repairs. Or, Alright, um, figure man shows A, the. Um, Figure A, the charging of the line, and B, um, at night with the uh, and and, dis and the charging line and uh, signaling the pump operator. Where's all right? Next page. On change of receiving, if the operator closes the discharge but continues to pump and holds it readily to open the valve at the proper signal, the um, perform A and, and part A and B at night and sees operation. Um, at, uh, one, on receipt of the operator and closes the discharge but continues to pump and holds himself ready to open the valve at the proper signal. During the day, the signal to shut off the water is given extending both arms downward at a bolt at an angle to 45 degrees, crossing them in front of the body and swinging them back and forth as is shown in figure A. And, um, 
Um, figure one, two, at the night is given by the extending at one arm down at the angle of the 45 degrees direction. The beam of the flashlight opens the lantern toward the bump area, swinging the arm back and forth in front of the body as shown in figure B, one, two. Unite, in cease operation, increase pressure, B and A. C, seizing operation. This, is, this signal means that the operation is over down. Receiving the operator, just engage the pump, disconnect all the lines, pick up the, this equipment. During the day, the signal is given by describing a circle in the front of the body with the extending arm is shown in figure A. Figure 1 3 at the night is given with the holding of the flashlight. <coughs> Lantern in the following same process, procedure to the daytime is shown in figure B. When we'll figure 1 3, increasing the pressure of the signal is given once at each of the 10 pounds of the. 4.5 kilograms increase the pressure required during the day. The signal is given with extended with the arm horizontally sideways, the shoulder raising up to 45 degree angle of the palms, always shown in figure A, four, figure 114. And that is given extending with one arm horizontally sideways from the shoulder, holding the light in the hand of the beam with the direction toward the pump operator, then raising the arm upward to the 45 degrees, as shown in B, B figure 14. Decreased pressure. Each of the signal indicates the degrees in the pump of the pressure of 10 pounds per square inch to the 0.7 kilograms per centimeter during the day. The, um, the signal is given with the extending of the arms horizontally from the shoulders, lowering them to a 45 degree angle, palms down, and shown in A. Um, the figure 1 5 at night is given with extend, extending with the one of the arm horizontally from the shoulder and holding them light, at light in one hand with the beam directed toward the pump operator and then lowering the arms at 45 degree angle shown in B in figure 5 t 4. All right, 124, other characteristics of the alarm system. A functional fire alarm system must have the following characteristics. Distribution quality, quantity of alarm boxes must be such that they can easily and quickly reach for the possible fire emergency location. The operation must be simple and that the person under the strain of the excitement are able to report the location of fire accurately. The alarms must be transmitted without the interference of the non-American non non emergency communication. The system must be able to operate properly under the, rest, under the stress, of the team, stress of the time and adversely climate conditions. Alarm systems must survive Fire, fires and other conditions which may be tended to cause a break and circuit break. The most frequent cause of alarm failures is inadequate impulse with the R, the fall, resulting in the falling of the fa falling, failing of the poles and trees, falling in the wire involving the commercial utilities, impacting the motor vehicles, wind, sleet, and the snow, electrical storms, sewer explosions, ex excavations which cut the distributed underground wires to assure the dependability of the alarm system. They must be inspected and tested, frequently kept in the optimum operating condition. Chapter 2, Clothing and Equipment.